Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Mommy. Today we are here with Noah. Say hi. We're in Yasmin's room, but we're here with Yasmin too. Say hi, baby. So we have a little bit. I'm gonna just step in up in a minute, but I caught COVID because my dad caught COVID, and then he gave it to my sister, and my sister came to visit, and she did stay her 15, 16 days actually, almost 17. But um, yeah. So caught COVID, took a little vacation, but we are back, guys. So here we're with this little mess, the guy. I had to change him. And then Yasmin's all ready to go. But he's actually gonna stay with grandma, so we're all good to go. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna go to Home Depot, hopefully Ross and Walmart. So yeah, and not too sure about stuff, but here, let me show you guys my sweet little girl. Say hi, Mama. Can you see? Say hi. Say hi. Hi. I'm determined to teach her how to say hi, so that's why I always tell her to say hi. Because I know babies can do that. So if you hear me ever say that, that's why. So yeah, we're going to get a couple things um, from here. That's why we're up here. And um, yeah, and then we're ready to go. You guys don't remember Yasmin's room? It's super cute, guys. And this little cheeks. She's five months old today, guys. So this is super crazy. Can't believe it. Little five month old. So yeah, let's go first. So I got these new glasses. They're super cute. They're actually from Amazon. Just got these changed because my other glasses were dying. Okay, so it's a super mess, but this is what I got from Walmart. I actually already owned this bra, but I went ahead and purchased it again because it's actually very good and it's a nursing bra. Bananas. Um, and then I got a gajillion of these because I want to trade my cups because I actually have these ones and I don't find these very useful to be honest. So um, yeah, I just wanted new ones because I reorganized this. So yeah, and then I reorganized this area so it's a little bit more nicer. Um, and I was looking actually for these plates, but I couldn't find them and they had them in a white color. This is more of an ivory and I don't want them in white because I know they will get um, very stained easily. So yeah, and the white was just a little too white for me. It looked like this. So yeah, I wanna go back to a different Walmart and get those. And I got more of these, which these are super practical. Got this spatula, I already have these, but this one went bad. And then I got this oat milk. I don't normally get this one because it's chocolate, but I thought it would be actually pretty cool to get this one. And then at Home Depot, we went ahead and got this. I needed this mop head. I got more antibacterial um, soap and um oh and this because let me show you guys can you see that beauty oh my god so my husband actually got me this beautiful fiddle leaf fig tree which is just beautiful it was the only one there and i saw it and i was like oh my god it's so beautiful but i honestly wasn't trying to buy it and my husband was like why not <laughs> So he was so sweet, it's super thin. I actually have to go back tomorrow and buy the bigger pot for it. And a couple of things that I need to maintain this beauty because it's not gonna be an easy job, but I have been wanting one for a long time, but I didn't really wanna commit because I know um, these can be, you know, like a child. So obviously I have my baby girl that's brand new to my life, but I decided I really wanted it and it was pricey. I mean, I don't know how much they really run for, to be honest, but it was 50 bucks. So, yeah. But it's so beautiful, guys. Um, It's pretty tall. Decent. But, yeah. So, I'm going to be taking care of this. 
for the rest of its life. Hopefully it's a long life. So I just got this package in. This is a brand new guana pod. Guna, guana, I'm not sure how you say it. But it is basically, she's been using one that was really, it said newborn on it, but honestly it looked really big. But it's finally to the point that it obviously, she is not a newborn, 16 pounder. So yeah, no newborn. So we got her, her size. This is, um, it doesn't say it on here, but it is a small three to nine months because she's a big girl now she's a big girl now huh mama so we got this and it's super comfy honestly like i love this it's only downfall to it is that if you want to wash it it's gonna take a long time to dry so it's really good though also i got this this actually I've had for a couple of days now it is a baby nail file kit um because i am terrified to cut her nails with a nail clipper it actually came with this too um i'm not sure if i'll be using it i'll see but she's playing with this right now but yeah so let me show you guys how it works because it's really really good so it has all these like like um modes which is slow fast or slower and faster so yeah so i'm gonna try it on r1 which is pretty decently so here mama look so it's very gentle which is exactly what i love so it's super easy so i wish i would have had this with my two boys it actually was very inexpensive i think it was 16 dollars um, she's hungry right now, so she's playing around. Um, but it's super easy. And she is going to be, you know, very well manicured now. So easy. So I absolutely love this. So it's great. And this is what it looks like. It has all of these little nail filers. Honestly, I don't think I'll be using any of them, but this last one over here, or first... But, um, yeah, it comes perfectly in a little cute box. Okay, guys, it's Yaz's bedtime literally soon. So she's getting really impatient, which means um, I need to bathe her and then get her to bed. So we're going to see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Um, it's literally like I don't know, like four or five days later. But um, yeah, so today we're here at home. I actually wanted to update you guys on my milk supply because, like I said. I caught COVID, had no symptoms, like no symptoms at all. By the way, my boys are upstairs playing. But um, my 
um what would it be like my reaction my it's not a symptom but um i forgot the word but basically what came with the fact that i had no symptoms no anything which i'm very thankful for because that's honestly a blessing to have covid and not have anything so i'm grateful i really am um but what came with that was actually i actually lost no, I didn't lose, but I almost, like, completely lost my milk supply, which was crazy because my daughter is literally just breastfed, like, latched on breastfed. She doesn't take a bottle. She doesn't, you know, we're here at home, so we really don't need to, um, we don't, I mean, we have my mother-in-law, but we can't even go out, so there's not really a point to, like, really focusing on giving her a bottle because I'm the one who cares for her, so... It's, you know, it's been fine, but basically, um, yeah, so I basically had lost, like, most of my milk support. Like, it was really weird because, like I said, she doesn't take a bottle, so how else do you feed a baby, you know? So I went ahead and fed her, um, I have loads and loads of milk, like I showed you guys, but I went ahead and fed her her milk, and, um, she was trying, I actually ended up making a bigger hole in the bottle, or the nipple of the bottle, and um um it kind of like got more milk in her but she would have to like be stood up or you know upright because she would choke easily but she ended up taking more but she still wasn't like gradually like doing it on her own so that was happening for about like more than a week it was really terrifying because i mean i'm not against formula i'm not against bottle feeding i'm not but what I am is like, this is my last baby or maybe my last baby, it, you know, and it's my daughter and then I'm her comfort and everything, you know, it's okay for me to be like, you know what, I want to nurse her like for as long, for however long she wants to be nursed, you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, so it kind of like took a little bit of a toll on me into not being depressed just being really really sad um my boy's going crazy in the house i i mean we couldn't go anywhere it's not like we could be like oh let's go to the store no we couldn't get go anywhere so it did take a toll on me um but i worked really 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 hard on getting it up um and we are in i mean we're more in the part where i'm able to feed her completely like latching on her or her latching on me sorry so i'm very very proud of myself because um i felt like nothing was working i felt like um i was taking supplements and it wasn't really working for me i was my water intake was amazing um and it wasn't working so i'm like really 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 happy because i wasn't depressed but i was almost in that neighborhood so it's kind of scary but um but yeah i might just make a video on that because i worked really really hard to get it back to where it was and or where she's like eating like literally latched on so i think i'll make a video on that but yeah but i think this video has been all over the place so i think i'm gonna end it here so thank you guys for watching and we will see you guys in the next one bye guys